my nightly routine is I, I usually wash my face. I'll switch between the gentle cleanser scrub and enzyme cleanser. Enzyme cleanser is what I would say I actually use the most. Yeah. I don't what I'm supposed to do, but it's just like a gentle exfoliator. And then I switched to, after that, I, I've been using a light retinol, but just a dot, because I don't want to yeah. do because I know yeah. that's an harm. But yeah, I, yeah, I know, I'm not the fan, but you know what? It doesn't really matter. It, you know, it doesn't, it's just my philosophy it doesn't mean like, you know, I, I'm not, you know, it doesn't mean, you know, it's just my advice. It's not even that I, you know, for some people, this works better than others, you know, it's just, um, yeah, it's just, just it. But you know, if you keep it like super little, I think that's good. And if you don't do it all the time, you know, I think, you know, yeah. breaks, I think it's good, you know. I don't do it all the time. So that's something that I'm proud of. And then after that, I use serum, hyaluronic serum. And I usually actually use that at night as opposed to in the morning because I like that it can kind of sit on the skin all night and like really do its job. Um, Cause in the morning I use the anti-pollution drops. Yeah. And then- So you also like it simple, no? You don't like to use too much. Simple, simple. Yeah. I found for my skin, I think it's something I've learned. It's important to definitely like surprise your skin by like switching up maybe the way you're going to exfoliate or the way you're gonna wash your skin. So like your skin doesn't get too used to a single product. But I don't like to do, I don't like to really do a lot of oils, to be honest with you. I, because I get fine to That's also good. You know, face oils are not, I, I don't recommend face oils at all because they shut down your own sebum production. And they also, you know, if you don't hydrate your skin, they disconnect with your skin and it can't really deliver the valuable oils into the skin. So um, it's not a good, good product anyway. Yeah. Exactly. And then I will use the, the eye cream, which is my absolute favorite. You already it's your it. favorite. It's your favorite. No, forever. No. Yeah. I, I don't think there's not a better one out there because I don't know if every people watching can understand this as well, but um, the pores around the nose are so sensitive, right? So if you yeah. use a really heavy eye cream, I found, I don't know if it's the way I'm applying it or if it just kind of transfers, but I found that it can cause in, in congestion around the nose area with their pores and make the make them show up more, make them a little bit darker. So I, like the blackheads basically are like way more prevalent. Whereas your eye cream feels way more water based and gentle and light and airy and fluffy. So like kind of it really penetrates in that exact spot instead of like seeping down and clogging the pores around your nose. It's a very good point, by the way, because, you know, um, rich doesn't mean hydration. You know, if it's like a rich, um, greasy cream, it sits on top. You know what I just said with the oils also is true for like super rich creams. If the hydration part is not right, these oils cannot really um, get into your skin. So if it goes, you know, around your nose, it definitely clogs your pores because you know, together with maybe um, unexfoliated cells, it causes blackheads on your nose. So those, um, you know, oils should not be around there. And, you know, my eye cream, I formulated in a way that it's, you know, it feels super light, but you you discover the richness on your skin and you see how, how it dissolves right into your skin, but gets the job done. It's, it's not, a, it's not it, it feels light, but the, um, the effect on the skin is insane. I, I find it so yeah. good. It's very hydrating. I completely agree. It doesn't sit on the skin. It definitely absorbs really well. And then I can also even get little breakouts like just under my yeah. eye from eye cream. If it's too yeah. heavy, it does feel like Vaseline, you know? And it's like, yeah. that's, that's never worked for my skin. So um, that's my favorite. And I also am a fan of the hydrating mist as well. 